You run about catching Pokemon up in those little balls you carry. Damn. <laughs> Alright, so we're back with Legends Arceus. So, a um, little bit of a different camera angle today. Um, trying some new stuff out. Um, I just kind of upgraded everything on my setup. So, um, we're just trying some new stuff. Uh, hopefully the camera angle doesn't look too bad. But, um, we're going, we're going into these ruins. Um, we got some stuff to do in here. I'm not sure all what we're going to do today, but I did want to say, I'm um, sorry for the lack of uploads recently. I know, um, it seems like every time I post a video, it's like, it's kind of a gamble when I'm going to post again, but, um, I've just been really busy, especially with the upgrades to the setup. Um, I'm going to do a setup tour soon because I really like how it's looking right now. So uh, keep an eye out for that, and once again, I do apologize for the lack of uploads here recently, but thank you for the support on the last video. It did fantastic compared to the rest of the videos on the channel, so thank you guys for watching that. So I'm Kala Kalalalaba of the Pearl <laughs> Clan, Warden Kalalaba to you. I'm just going to say her name like that. Would you look at that? You have a Celest Celestica flute? I thought it was a Celestia. You must be the one who's, who they say fell out of the space-time rift. I am. That's right. Make sure we're recording on everything. We are. Cool. I see, I see, blah, blah, blah. I've already heard about you that you quelled Cleavor in his frenzy. I'm sure many people were saved by your actions, but I wonder if there wasn't some other way to handle the situation. What what you did is hardly different from bullying a Pokemon into submission, after all. I wouldn't say we did all that. And you run about catching Pokemon up in those little balls you carry. I don't need any help from your sort, or the Diamond Clan for that matter. The young lady, Arizu, offered to help, but associating with the Diamond Clan, it just won't do. That's a little, a little much. I don't know if, I don't know how I feel about this lady, I'm gonna be honest with you. See, look, she, <laughs> here's Volo. Um, how about you show me the strength that quelled? Yeah, sure, why not? We're gonna fight Volo real fast. He's got a Togepi. This guy, I do not trust this man. And I keep seeing, like, I haven't had the game spoiled for me, but I see people talking about how much they hate him all the time. So, uh, that's gonna. Okay, that didn't do too bad. She did use Draining Kiss, which is gonna put her. Oh, shoot, that put her a lot higher. <coughs> Higher than I thought. Oh gosh, sorry for sneezing. Um, two aerial ways. I keep forgetting that we can run around during battles. Like I always forget that that's a. God dang it! That's not good. We're gonna have to use roost. <clears throat> Now we're gonna use the like, strong style, hopefully. That'll. Oh, wait, no, that's not what I meant to do. This one I meant to do. This should take it out. Oh, shoot, not at all. Not one bit. This Toby's in my ass. Hmm. You gotta use Roost again. <clears throat> Why does Another he keep using one. that? You didn't even need to that time. <sighs> this Togepi's kind of, kind of running a, running us around real fast. It's gonna use it again. Why? Another one. All right, this time I'll just go for it. I'm just gonna go for the aerial ace. Uh, strong style gust. Another one. Yeah. Let's see what else we got in here. Uh, I'm just gonna 
can go up there and area lace. It's gonna take us out. I know it is, but of course. Why? Another one. That's so annoying. It just spams draining kids. Okay, we'll just throw in Luxio and take it out real fast. We got a free switch in. Oh well. This isn't a Nuzlocke, so I'm not too worried about it, but still annoying. And then he's got a Gibble. He's Bulldoze. I knew that was going to happen immediately. Oh well. We'll send in Buzel. Buzel's level 17, so it's not horrible. I'm just going to use Octave. Hopefully, two of these will take it out. Nope, not at all. This will give us an extra move in there. Oh, should have stuck with the. Uh... All right, so if we just do Aqua Jet, just regular Aqua Jet two should take it out. Yeah, I was gonna say. So it destroyed our first two Pokemon, but oh well. If this was a Nuzlocke, I'd be more upset about it, but... Oh well. Oh my, you're quite obliged. Screw you, Bolo. You suck. But, Floatzel, or Buzel, um, leveled up, so that's good. He healed our Pokemon. Can't be too mad about that. So, okay, this is what we gotta do. We gotta retrieve a wall fragment. So, it's right there. Um, ah, oh, this is what we gotta do. There's like three sisters we have to fight. Forgot about this. Okay, so we have to check the Mirelands camp. This way. We can use some of these. <clears throat> Did I? I already seen this scene. So. I always forget that you can dash. I cannot see anything like that. Oh, we already made it. I was gonna say I could not see anything. So we're investigating. It's a burnout campfire. Somebody must have been here. It doesn't, it doesn't look like it's burnt out. It looks like it's ready to go. Now, who might you be? Not some stray traveler from the look of you. There's only one reason people go poking around out here in the middle of nowhere. You're after us three, aren't you? Sisters, we should introduce ourselves properly before we show this poor fool how wrong he was to assume that he could ever beat us. Whatever. There's Charm. There's Clover. And Coin. So these are basically just old Team Rocket. The way they're posing. We're the infamous bandit trio of the Mis Misfortune Sisters, and your luck's just run out. Oh, jeez. Let me handle this a while, and I hurt him a little bit. Come on, Toxicroak. Let's douse this fool with poison. It's a little much if you ask me. I mean, I don't think I deserve to be poisoned. Alright, so she sent a Toxic Crow. We sent out Dartrix. We could probably one shot this fool. Okay. That was not what I was hoping for. That was rough. 
Ah, shoot. <laughs> Nartrix is dead. Second time this episode, too. We'll send in Staravia. Take this fool out. We'll just use Gust again. Just normal Gust, I'll take it out. Too easy. And the battle has been decided. I'm not fond of this outcome, but at least it at least it's still better than plowing fields for the galaxy team. Okay, so three Pokemon leveled up and Dartrix is fainted, so. The Galaxy team continues to spoil things for me even after I've left. Take the blasted fragment and go. Just leave us alone. You, so we already got the wall fragment. Too easy, man. The weird writing on it made us think the stupid thing was some sort of treasure. Um, I want to help Ursula. Luna. Goodness, how selfless are you? Blah, 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 blah. Why is it in days of spring beneath the soft caress of the sun the blossoms tremble and fall, spirits lashed by uncertainty? Your days are also numbered, galaxy fool. Okay, so just... <clears throat> Alright, so Darstrix has died like three times this episode. So now we're gonna revive him real fast. We have two, so we're we're chilling on that, but Whew, it's rough. And then that should be good. Alright, so now we need to head back to um <clears throat> where we were originally. Because we need to return the wall fragment, which we got a lot faster than I was expecting us to. I thought maybe it'd be a little harder than that. Oh shoot. I thought he was gonna knock us off the horse. <laughs> the, I saw the horse. The weird ear. Volo did not do anything to help. He literally stood there. He has not moved a single muscle since we left. Meanwhile. Shoot. <laughs> Dartrix is dead. Good work, very good work. You like, you did nothing. Okay, now we're gonna put this put this wall fragment back in the wall. Too easy, man. Oh, so you come to bother me again? What would her voice sound like? We haven't been doing voices recently for the channel at all, and I think we should. Oh, so you've come to bother <laughs> That's so oh, bad, bro. Brother, oh, so you've come to bother stinks. me again. Well, come as often as you like, but it won't change my mind. This wall fragment. <laughs> what? You went and retrieved the fragment from those bandits? Why go out of your way like that for a complete stranger like me? I guess that you're eager to call Marceluna, hmm? That's right. This is so bad. I'll admit it, I didn't expect anybody else to truly care for Ursaluna. Well then, let's see that wall fragment. It's like, it's almost like <laughs> doofenshmirtz instead of an old lady. And there we go, good as new. And then, it, oh, it's written in unknown, that's cool. Let me read what it says. All lives touch other lives to create something new and alive. I see. I suppose it means people helping each other, like how you helped retrieve the fragment. I've read this passage many, many times, but this is the first time I've truly understood what it means. Maybe this is Almighty Sinnoh's guidance. At first it's like, it almost sounded like a Doofenshmirtz for a second instead of like just an old lady. I see, Ross, please, <laughs> please, please lend me your strength so that we may help Ursaluna. It's true that Ursaluna has become enraged, but he doesn't seem to be in an utter frenzy. I think he will return to a normal state even if we can just give him some medicine. I can never bring myself to engage Pokemon in battle, but that's something I can rely on you for, am I right? Okay, I'm done doing that voice for today. Yep, so, uh, so we return the wall fragment. That's about it for this video. Peace.